Hey everybody, welcome back to Tales of Symphonia. So, we got some potion for that one little fuck muffet. And now we're back at the Earth Shrine. We... Well, Big Brother came back and all. Yeah, sure, go on. Thank you. Ah, uh, you don't thank me, honey. You're making me blush. <laughs> that sounds like someone we know. What? That's what I'm like? Talk about a shock. Let's go. Hey, isn't anyone going to say something? Celos, I think that you and that small child are different. Oh, Prisea. Prisea, not all questions require a response. In this case, it is fine to ignore Zelos. I see. You're one to talk. I wonder. Well, it looked odd. <coughs> Monster! You're in for a world of hurt. Let's have you tie me. Ah! That was disappointing. Fine pellets. Ooh, Ring got more TP. It must only be like three or four points. More battles? Not bad, am I? Hmm. Thank you, Prisea. For what? For rescuing me. But it was my fault you were kidnapped. No, it wasn't. It was Rodile's fault. You mustn't worry about it, okay? I want to become like you. No, you don't. Huh? I want to become someone who can smile and forgive everything. Right. Uh oh, there's a. I don't care for points, man. <laughs> Check upstairs first. <clears throat> hmm? Ah, monster! Much of a Asshole monster. I 
Spawn after you're in a world of hurt. Okay, well, shit respawned, and we'll just head in here. <laughs> what? You losers got a problem? You wanna fight? Are they all like this? They must have a poor upbringing. Just like you. Ouch, Sheena, that's harsh. What are you babbling about? What are you here for? We wish to go further in. Would you mind letting us through? You want me to let you through for free? The world don't work that way, kid. Not again. You and your brothers look and act way too much alike. So what do you... what is it you want? What is spicy like? Does spicy taste good? Give me something spicy to eat. Who wants to eat something spicy? Hmm, I can't really think of anything. I don't think we have any recipes for spicy food. Yeah. It looks like we'll have to go find a recipe. Now that I think about it, Altessa's home smelled of spices. Perhaps Altessa or Tabitha like spicy food. Hmm? What? Ah, well, you sure pick up some odd things you make note to make note of. Anyway, putting aside Regal's interest for the moment, let's go to Altessa's house. Gonna be a piece of Yeah. Oh, usually oh it's the water shrine or something along those lines that are annoying as all fuck. In this game. It's the Earth Shrine. The Earth Shrine is the annoying ass shrine. <laughs> it is a raging storm, a steel storm that mows down all. Nothing is left after her battle. Ooh, HP, TP, and defense. Bellbane? Venom. When did we get that? Oh yeah. Wait. Yeah, there's the lunar ring. The fuck did we just pick up? Oh! 
Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Five plus. Oh, those are cracked platforms, so... Theoretically, I'm going to guess that with the Earthquake this Ring of Shadows... This is going to be a piece of cake! That was pathetic. Well, let's go in the other directions and see if there are any more gnomelet fuck muffins that... Ow! Go and get me this item, human! How does that thing even have a oh, back? Right. You're in for a world of hurt. Fucking Christ on the goddamn bike! <laughs> Fucking combo to shit! Eh, I still make profit, I guess. <clears throat> Hmm, mithril bracelet. Uh It's an erector anal bleed anal bead. Are you okay? That was just warming up. Yeah, <sighs> we're not gonna be able to get past this. It looks like we'll have to find another way around. World shaking. Getting the RNG on the HP ups. This is going to be a piece of. <laughs> Pretty good. <laughs> 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 
Stop! Who's next? Not much of a specimen. Help is on the way. Healing circle. Not a bad exercise, was it? Well, at least we got some super pellets. Reinforcements, huh? <laughs> Rising Ready? I was just warming up. Almost had them to turn off healing circle because I don't care for Fun run. I don't care for pointless battles. <laughs> Hmm. Well, off to El Tesla's house to learn how to make spicy More shit. Tessa, leave me brain. Hi, Lloyd. 
Welcome. Sorry to bother you, Tabitha, but we've got a favor to... Hmm? What's that wonderful smell? I just finished making curry. That's it. We need a recipe for a spicy dish. What do you mean? I understand. Here is the recipe. Hurry! And here are the ingredients. Curry requires three ingredients. Rice, onion, and red satay. Thanks, you're a big help. You are welcome. Alright then. Curry! A moderate amount of HP and MP. Mmm. Mm. Genus the penis cannot cook curry. Sheena knows how to cook curry. Well, Sheena, looks like it's time for you to get in the kitchen. So help me, if I have to leave this goddamn dungeon one more fucking time, I'm going to be very salty. The fuck? <clears throat> Who will cook? Hmm. Sheena had the best. Sheena, how about you make some? What? Me? Well, sure, if you want. Oh, so this is spicy? How is it? Pretty good, huh? Oh, spicy! Spicy! He probably doesn't understand what spicy is. Oh well, it's fun to cook every now and then. Wouldn't want to get out of practice. Uh oh, Sheena. What does that mean? You practicing your cooking for when you get married? I didn't expect to hear that from you, of all people. No, it's not that. Sheesh. Hey, this is good. This is delicious, Sheena. Really? Using pineapple's the trick. What? You, you, you don't usually put pineapple in curry. But you just said it was good! Yeah, but that's still not something that goes in curry. <laughs> You're weird, Sheena. It brings out the sourness, it makes it taste better, and it does taste good, see? Pineapple is not normally used in curry. Meh. What, you losers got a problem? You wanna fight? The reactions are identical to the point that it's just getting silly. No, we don't have any business with you. Mm, your face says, We came here to meet the summon spirit of Earth, but we're spending all our time dealing with these weirdos. And we may still get stuck again in some place. Maybe we should have just kept going and not wasted time stopping here. But then again, this guy might be useful or something, right? What kind of face is that? You want me to help you? What? What do you want this time? What? Nothing. Don't need nothing. This one is nice. Please help us. Okay then, I'll be waiting at the secret passage up ahead, so hurry. Ah. 
Ha! Oh, victory is mine! Fuck. This is gonna be a piece of cake! Rising Alright! What? I feel so cheated. Further. Seriously, just step on them. Oh, you guys. You're the ones who gave me potion. You must be Big Brother. They all look the same, it's so hard to tell. Do you want to go back up? Use this hole. It's a secret passage that only gnome, gnome lets use. Thanks, Big Brother. Big chasm further in. We have to drop down the. We have to drop the path above down onto it to get past it. I'll go on over there. What do we do there? I'll tell you when we get there. All right. Okay, I'm going now. But do something about those monsters along the way. It's really annoying when one of them touches me. So I need to make sure no enemies touch you, right? Yeah. Or it's a big fuss if they do. going to be a piece of cake. So, how... Use Rising Falcon. Amazing. Get over here, flappy arm thing. You're in for a world of hurt. Oh, 
Oh, you're here. So, what do we do now? You and I are going to cause an earthquake at the same time. Then the path will fall down, okay? I get it. We're going to increase the strength of the shock. I'll say one, two, three, so match your timing with mine and use the swords and ring. If we do it a few times, it'll fall. Gotcha. Wanna hear that again? Nah. Okay, then, here we go. One, two... Once more. Not quite yet. got us killed! Huh. I didn't think about what, ha what happened after it fell. Uh, if we didn't have these extras, we'd be dead. Everybody makes mistakes. <laughs> well, I'm going now. Yeah, thanks. Treasure! Need treasure. You go eat a dick. See if I can try. Okay. So there's one there. Thing on the way. I don't care for what this bad That was disappointing. Did that actually use my ingredients? She Yes, it actually did. We didn't actually have any pineapple either. Where'd she get the pineapple from? I don't care for what you said. Just as I expected. Hmm. Ah, fuck. Bartichet. Why not? What is your excuse for not letting us progress? Other than the fact that you really, really, really must want to die. Cock. Cock. Shit. No! No slug monster. Eat a dick. This is gonna be a piece of rising falcon. This is gonna be a piece of rising falcon? That was just warming up. Okay, so I, fall, I seem to fall through that one path. Maybe I take the middle one? Aha. Ghost shell.
I got boots made out of dead shit. I'm gonna kick you in the face. Wait, do we already have an ancient rod? Yeah, she already has an ancient build though. Oh well, now Regal has boots made out of dead people and he's kicking other things in the face with them. Oh, it's all good. No slug monster! One fight after another. Rising <laughs> face my salt! <laughs> oh, mollusk beast! <laughs> Wrong guy to mess with. Well, at, least we have, at least we're getting money now. Uh, eh. I mean, technically that still might as well be broke, but... Oh boy. At least they're kind enough to put a save point before the boss fight. You know what? Fuck it. Sheena... Eh... 20-27%. Honestly, doing that more for the, uh... For the TP? I mean, it's, it's good. It's a good recovery on both fronts, but... I think we're getting... Eh... I don't know. Yeah, I'll take that for now. Yep, here we go. Bring it, bitch! I'll stab you in your fucking stones. So this is known. What in the goddamn fuck? Since Bolt was Undini's opposite, Gnomes is... Ifrit! If we wake up Ifrit, that'll sever their mana flow, right? No, it's Sylph. Honestly, how many times do I have to tell you before you actually remember it? Yeah, that I see that the level of education in Silverant matches the status of the world. Yeah, I guess you could say that. Lloyd, that was not a compliment. All right, here we go. Hmm, so you're a summoner, huh? Well, look, sorry, but I've already got a pact with Mythos, okay? There's Mythos' name again. He must have been amazing. I am Sheena. I seek a pact with Gnome. I ask that thou annul thy pact with Mythos and establish a new pact with me. Man, you sure use some stuffy language. Blech. Um, well, I mean, this is how I was taught to do it. Really? Oh, yeah, well, whatever. All right, show me what you got. Bring it on. Come on. <laughs> You still got a platypus mutant hedgehog? Fucking. Fuck if fuck I know. Ready? 
Until he does ground dasher. Oh, you guys fight dirty, you know that? I mean, what's up with the four on one garbage? Mythos? Well, he did it by himself. Oh, yeah, well, whatever. Make your vow already. Man, everything involving Earth in this is a dick. Oh, this guy is hard to deal with. For the sake of creating a place in which the two worlds no longer must sacrifice one another, give me your power. Hmm. Well, all right. I'll go ahead and lend my power to you guys. I agree. Whoa, so it's been like what, uh, four thousand years? How's it going? Looking good. It has been a long time, hasn't it? it seems that the mana flow between us has been severed. Yep, uh, there's gonna be an earthquake here in a bit. After all, we just basically ripped out the mana link. Hello? Yeah, that pretty much sums it up. Take care, everyone! See y'all later! Okay, later! <laughs> oh, wait. Shit, we might want to leave. All right, just like we planned. But you know, I've been thinking. If the worlds are separated from each other, we're not going to be able to see each other again, are we? Why not? We can just go back and forth with the Riards. Right now, we can move in between the worlds because they're connected by the flow of mana. But if the worlds are split apart, we don't know what will happen. So the instant the flow of mana is severed, the two worlds may part ways forever. Will that mean that when we form the pact with the final summoned spirit, we'll all have to say goodbye? We don't know if that's really the case, so there's no point in worrying about it right now. True. Where shall we go next? I've heard that the summoned spirit, Celsius, resides near Flanor. Okay then, let's go have a look. Now we can call an obnoxious gopher to burrow up the buttholes of our enemies. Home sure is cute. Cute? Really? 
Just look at that ribbon on his head. And the way it spins and spins and spins. If we're talking about ribbons, Bersaia is cute too. My ribbon does not spin. Bersaia, wait! Seriously though, I don't think that thing on Gnome is a ribbon. I don't care for pointless battles. Damn. I was just warming up. At some point, we're gonna have to go. We do have to go back to Silveron anyway, because we weren't actually able to get the seal for uh, was it the light seal. Because the chick was like, "Find Aska. Aska's gone, yo." So we gotta find, go find a big, you know, glowing bird. It's an earthquake. It's just like Gnome said. It's the proof that the flow of mana has been severed. The earthquake at the Renegade base may may have been caused by it as well. Splitting apart worlds is no minor task. One can expect the land to react to these unforeseen events with at least an earthquake or two. Oh, uh, at some point... We'll go back and maybe actually free shock a lot. Maybe. Possibly. Meh, it could happen. You gotta like how everyone just kinda forgot about her. I mean, yeah, she was a dumb bitch anyway, so who really cares? But it's sorta of like, yeah. What's up, fuckers? Welcome to the Olive Village. Five hundred... Five hundred gold. God... I never got that. It was just like, Oh, you're getting further into the game. Well, prices are going up on later... Later in visits. Why's that? Prices are going up on later in visits. Are you going to explain why? Progression. It's like so, some shitty ass little fucking inn. Huh? Are you alright? <gasps> Please hang on. I'm sorry. It seems I've been struck by evil energy. Evil energy? Do you by any chance possess the devil's arms? Devil's arms? The evil eye that you possess is one of the devil's arms. Who are you? My apologies. My name is Abyssian. I'm the last surviving member of my family of demon hunters. I'm Lloyd. I'm on a journey with my companions. What does the family of demon hunters do? There was once a man named Nibelum who attempted to conquer Tethiala. Nibelum was eventually defeated by, his, def yeah, defeated by a single swordsman. But his lingering hatred fused itself into the swordsman's nine pieces of arms that cursed the swordsman's descendants. Wow, that's pretty scary. The family of demon hunters are the descendants of the swordsman who defeated Niblum. Every member of the family lost their lives to the curse of the devil's arms. That's terrible. Can anything be done? If all nine items are gathered and sealed, the family curse will be lifted. So that's why you asked us about the devil arms. Yes, however, the curse has progressed more quickly than I expected. And I, too, have been struck by Nibelum's evil energy. I think it will be difficult for me to continue gathering the Devil's Arms in my condition. Let's help him out, Lloyd. Yeah, after all, we already have some Devil's Arms. Well, let's find the rest ourselves. Are you sure? It is not a minor task. Warven Vow number two. Never abandoned someone in need. Then please, take the sword and key. The Devil's Arms carry the will of Nibelum, and the 
pieces respond to each other. When this sword reacts, you will surely find devil's arms in that area. When you've collected all the arms, please return to, fl to Flanoir. Does the curse of the devil's arm affect anyone besides the members of your family? Hmm. No, it shouldn't. What is it, Prisea? No, it's nothing. Okay then, we'll be back soon, Abyssian. Thank you, I mean you're dead. So, is this like... Ah. I'm good for that thing. I don't remember this quest. Anyway, I think there's like a cave or something somewhere where we can... Oh, hey. The fuck? It's Kratos. What are you doing? It's nothing. I was just looking at the sky. Don't lie. Hmm. Then how about... I was scheming how to get rid of those that are in Lord Big Brass's way. Now are you satisfied? You seem well. What? Lloyd, don't be so trusting. There may be those close to you who are malicious. You're talking about yourself. Hmm. We'll, we'll see. Be ever judicious. Now I shall excuse myself. I forgot to ask what judicious means. Aha! Victory is mine! Is that the ice place? Ah! Monster! This is going to be a piece of cake. Kick me in the fucking ankles, you cock knocker. Oh, overall red. Okay, that is the Temple of Ice. means that perhaps around... Hmm? I wonder what the relationship between Regal and Persea is. Beats me, but it sure seems like Regal has around his mind, though. I wonder if he has a crush on her. No way! Their age difference is way too great. It's an adult and a child. Yeah, I guess you're right. I wouldn't be so sure about that. What do you mean? Age difference has no meaning in love. I know a, co a countess who married a man 30 years younger than she is. Persea's mine. I won't give her up. Rapey half-elves. I tell ya. Very unlike you to be brooding. Hey, what are you trying to say? Well, you act like there's nothing wrong even when there is. What? You really seem to. I mean, to uh, forget it. What? Come on, Zelos, you can tell me. No, 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 it's not like me. Anyway, you just totally impressed me with what you just said. Oh? Oh, that's all you have to say? Oh? Yes, oh. I could have swore that dude said there was like a cave around. Where you would find penguinists. Huh? 
Maybe it is the Ice Temple. Anyway, though, before we go gallivanting off into a new dungeon, it's about... Yeah, it's close enough to end the video. So I'll catch you all next time. Adios.